Lou Sunday arranged a night towing exercise, and as the crew were arriving at HQ, we received a call for an assist to a 10-meter yacht with engine trouble anchored in the bay. Frank was on shift in the radio room and called out the names of crew that were already assembled and available to leave immediately. The remaining crew en route to the base were allocated to our secondary rescue vessel. Let's go and get this yacht, that'll be the first, first assist for her. Come back, put the yacht up, goes in the canal. On, um, you can see the front starting to come up, the wind is not really accelerated for what it's supposed to be. Yeah. Yeah. Ready to do the action. Having a radio direction finder on board helps us to pinpoint the direction of the target vessel's VHF transmission and gives us the certainty that we're not wasting a second in heading straight for the casualty. In this case there was no drama, but in some circumstances those few seconds can be vital to success. On entering sheltered waters, we need to confirm where the vessel needs to be berthed. This informs what side we raft up on, as once in the narrow creeks of the Kiwana Waters Canal, it will be hard to change things. Good side. You haven't got a good side. Oh. <laughs>